Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Undertale. This is Vita Fuser. In our last episode, we made it to the Metaton Resort. We also went through a musical segment. Uh And we also met Burger Bands. Also, Sans told us the reason he's been sticking with us is because he apparently met Toriel, and uh, they have a shared proclivity for knock knock jokes. Alrighty, time for us to go. Nobody else is supposed to be here. Oh, well, we can't worry about that now. Welcome to the core. Ready? This is it. Take the elevator up to the top of the core. The elevator isn't working. What? The elevator should be working. Well then, go to the right and keep heading up. Alright, now just keep heading up. That pit isn't on my map. Forget it, let's try the left side. Okay, you should be able to make it through here. Watch out! Magic pops out of its hat. Clear mind. Abracadabra. Magic does a mysterious jig. Magic interrupts you by chattering to itself. It seems satisfied. Alakazam! That was close. Why are there so many monsters here? I mean, it's no problem, right? We've just got to keep heading forward. Looks like you can't proceed until you hit the switch. But those lasers will activate when you do. Um, I'm sure they'll come in this order. Orange, orange, blue. Got it? Move until the third one. Oh my god, are you okay? I'm sorry, I gave you the wrong order. Everything's fine? Okay. Let's just keep heading to the right. The crossroads? Uh, uh... Try heading to the right. Wait, no! I think you should get up! Night, night blocks the way. You sing an old lullaby. Night, night starts to look sleepy. Good night. Smashes her morning star. Yeah, she's using the good morning star. A very wicked looking uh, weapon. Keep singing. Night Night closes its eyes a bit. Goodbye. Smells like stardust. Keep singing. Night Night falls asleep. You take that nap. Sorry, I... I... I thought that... Let's try the right path instead. Um, more lasers? 
Okay, I I won't mess around this time. I'll just deactivate the lasers and let you through. They're they're not turning off. I can't turn them off. I it, it's okay. I have this under control. I'm gonna turn off the power for the whole node. Then you can walk across. Okay, go, go, go. Wait, stop! Power is turning itself back on. Damn it! I didn't supposed to. I I turn it off again. When it turns off, move a little and then stop. Okay? You won't get hurt. See? I got everything under control. Everything's under control. Have no doubt. I'm in control. You may think Jason Ghost is thrilling, but you need to know who's really in control. I know, I had to. Gotta have at least a little, Tim Curry. Okay, you should, you should, I don't know. This doesn't look like my map at all. I'm sorry, I, I, I have to go. The smell of ozone fills you with determination. North, the warrior's path. West, the sage's path. Any path leads to the end. East, the end. Fun fact, you only really have to do one path. The warrior's path, as you probably guessed. Has lots of fighting. The Sage's Path, I believe, has something else. Oh, so that's where those ice goes. It cools the core. Solve this puzzle and the end will open. Let's see, the Northwest version of this has a glam burger. Why not relax and have a nice snack? Alrighty, we have one of these puzzles. Complicated puzzle, my boy. Patience, I will make my way through. Now, if you didn't want to do either of those paths, you could just wait there and the force field would deactivate itself. Now, if you were going through the warrior's path, you would fight Whimsalot, Final Froggit, and Astigmatism. Three unique monsters in that path. To the east, this is the end. This is the end. Oh! Here's astigmatism. You don't pick on astigmatism. Don't pick on me. 
Behind this door must be the elevator to the king's room. Okay. Here's our final boss of the court. Oh yes, there you are, darling. It's time to have our little showdown. It's time to finally stop the malfunctioning robot. Not. Malfunction? Reprogramming? Get real. This was all just a big show. An act. Alphys has been playing you for a fool the whole time. I figured as much. As she watched you on the screen, she grew attached to your adventure. She desperately wanted to be a part of it. So she decided to insert herself into your story, in one of those fix. She reactivated puzzles, she disabled elevators, she enlisted me to torment you. As someone who uh, used to do internet RPing, I know this a little too well. Eh. I don't do that anymore. Also, she could save you from dangers that didn't exist. Also, you would think she's the great person that she's not. And now it's time for her finest hour. At this very moment, Alphys is waiting outside the room. During our battle, she will interrupt. She will pretend to deactivate me, saving you one final time. She'll be the heroine of your adventure. You'll regard her so highly, she'll even be able to convince you not to leave. Or not. You see, I've had enough of this predictable charade. I have no desire to harm humans. Far from it, actually. My only desire is to entertain. After all, the audience deserves a good show, don't they? And what's a good show without a plot twist? <clears throat> hey! What's going on? The door just locked itself. Sorry, folks! Old program's been cancelled, but we got a finale that will drive you wild. <clears throat> real drama, real action, real bloodshed. On our new show, Attack of the Killer Robot. Seriously, his metal body is invulnerable. Yes, I was the one that rearranged the core. I was the one that hired everyone to kill you. That, however, was a short-sighted plan. You know what would be a hundred times better? Killing you myself. Listen, darling, I've seen you fight. You're weak. If you continue forward, Asgore will take your soul. And with your soul, Asgore will destroy humanity. But if I get your soul, I can stop Asgore's plan. I can save humanity from destruction. Yeah, these games. I'm not really good at them. Then using your soul, I'll cross through the barrier and become the star I've always dreamed of being. Hundreds, thousands, millions of humans will watch me. Don't hit the bombs. Glitz, glamour, I'll finally have it all. So what if a few people have to die? That's show business, baby! I can't see what's going on in there, but... Don't give up, okay? There's one last way to beat Metatime. It's a... Uh, it's a... Uh, it's a work in progress, so don't judge it too hard. But you know how Metatime always faces forward? That's because there's a switch on his backside! So if you can turn... Can turn him around and, uh... uh press that switch... He'll be, uh, He'll be, uh, Vulnerable. We gotta go! There is a mirror behind it. Oh? A mirror? Right, I have to look perfect for our grand finale. I don't 
see it. Where is it? Did you just flip my switch? Switch, that can only mean one thing. You're desperate for the premiere of my new body. How rude. Lucky for you, I've been aching to show this off for a long time. So as thanks, I'll give you a handsome reward. I'll make your last living moments... Absolutely beautiful! So you turned yourself into David Bowie, huh? Metaton EX makes his premiere. This guy is fairly tough to spare. In order to spare him, you need to get his ratings all the way up to that yellow line. Lights, camera, action! Drama, Romance, Bloodshed. I'm the idol everyone craves. Smile for the camera! Oh, it's time for Pop Quiz! I hope you brought a keyboard. This is an essay question! You get a gold star. David Bowie. Your essay really showed everyone your heart. Why don't I show you mine? Keep up the pace. All right. Lights, camera, bombs. Things are blowing up! Time to 
time for our union regulated break. Jeez. You've grown so distant, darling. Have another heart to heart. How am I not getting hit by these and I keep not get oop? Uh, arms! Who needs arms with legs like these? I'm still gonna win! That's where I thought I was gonna die. Ah. Uh. Alrighty, here we go again. So, after the first fight, you can actually spare Meditan and get to the second... Yeah, you can do that. Clever. Very clever. Sometimes the fewest words speak the loudest. Uh, yeah, it's very meta. Ah! I don't get it. I got through this the fir without any damage the first time. Why am I screwing up now? on the dance floor. Thank you. 
It's actually fairly funny that the audience isn't going to uh, penalize me for this. Death by Glamour. I've had a little bit too much Death by Glamour.
You really want humanity to perish, but you just believe in yourself that much. How inspiring! Well, darling, it's either me or you, but I think we both already know who's gonna win. Witness the true power of humanity's star! He's lost his legs. Then, are you the star? Can you really protect humanity? Ah! Darn it! Made it to the end. Choked at the very end. I think I'm gonna need another glam burger from this. At least I don't have to do this again.
Nice, you get a gold star. Yes, they really showed everyone your heart. Why don't I show you mine? Always that part. Oh, I'm just warming up.
Oh, look at these ratings! I did it! That's how you spend it. spare a meta time. You gotta get that ratings up. This is the most viewers I've ever had! It's way the hell more than I've got. I've still got 57. Or maybe at least... It's, it's 57 subscribers and 300-something views. We've reached the viewer colon milestone. One lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me. Before I leave the underground forever! Wow. That really devolved from uh, Markiplier to uh, like like a uh, Jewish comedian. Let's see who calls in first. Hi, you're on TV. What do you have to say on this? Our last show. Oh, it's Nastablook. Hi, Metaton. I really liked watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but. Seeing you on the screen brought excitement to my life, vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is our last episode? I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. Oh. No, wait! Wait! Blue! Blue And they already hung up. I'll take another caller! Metaton, your show made us so happy. Metaton, I don't know what I'll watch without you. Metaton, there's a Metaton hole shaped hole in my Metaton shaped heart. I, uh, I, I see. Everyone, thank you so much, darling. Perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters. No, no, they only have me. If I left, the underground would lose its spark. I'd leave an aching void that can never be filled. So I think I'll have to delay my big debut. Besides, you've proven to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough to get by Asgore. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. <laughs> it's all for the best anyway. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is... inefficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power, and, uh... Well! I'll be alright. Knock him dead, darling! And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience! Hi. I managed to open a lock. Are you too? Oh my god. Metaton! Metaton, are you? My god, it's just the just the batteries. I ended up taking off his little arms and legs. Sure, he's a robot, you can rebuild his arms and legs, but still, that can't have been pleasant for him. Metaton, if you were gone, I would've... I would've... If we actually took out Metaton, we would be unable to get the right ending, because a Alphys would've, wouldn't have been very happy with us. I mean, hey, it's no problem, you know? He's just a robot. If you messed it up, I could always just build another. Why don't you go on ahead? So, that's what that diagram meant. Alphys basically put a ghost in a robot shell. In this case, that building right next to Naftablook's building, that belonged to uh, Metaton. I just need a moment. Alrighty. Sorry about that. Let's keep going. So, you're about to meet Asgore, huh? You must be... You must be... Pretty excited about all that, huh? You finally... You finally get to go home! Wait! I mean, uh, 
I mean, I I was just gonna not say goodbye and I can't take this anymore. I I lied to you. A human soul isn't long enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes a human, at least a human soul, and a monster soul. If you want to go home, you have to take his soul. You have to kill Asgore. I'm sorry. Wow, it's a long elevator. Everything's in sepia tone. Alrighty, we're done there in our next episode. We'll see what's going up for us. Later!